Nationals have done that a bit this series. De La Cruz right center. Thomas over. Misses the ball on the slide. De La Cruz eyeing three. Thomas just now gathers. Standing up at third base, Ellie De La Cruz. Broke his bat, little flare. De La Cruz extends and takes one away. Excellent play by Ellie. And then you've got the sensation. Someone throwing. Yep. De La Cruz out to left. Well, he may have to soon. That's over the head of Marsh. One hop off the wall. The throw comes into second base. It'll be a double for De La Cruz. De La Cruz to right. That is down base hit. Windmill on for Fraley. He scores. De La Cruz up to second. A standing ribby double. The Reds have a 3-0 lead. De La Cruz has an 11-game hit streak going back to last year. Wheeler comes in there with... Location was so much harder when you're just sitting in a classroom and, and learning, but when you could actually... De La Cruz up the line here. He's going to leg this out for a double, Taylor. I mean, it, you... You can speak to this. His personality, I'm sure he wants to get more. Payoff is crushed. Deep center. Off the top of the batter's eye. De La Cruz destruction. And a 9-3 Reds edge. Look at the extension on this ball. My goodness. This ball was absolutely hammered. Ellie De La Cruz, a big league home run his last time up. Bomb. First pitch, center field. Freelich was deep coming on. He slides and gets by. De La Cruz can fly. He storms to second. Churio gathers edge of the track. Windmill is on. Relay to the plane. De La Cruz. If you got him at 6 2. A little two seamer right there. Look at that. Head down behind the baseball. Great extension. Yeah, Ellie's not locked in. And yet, his success rate has spiked a lot in these last handful of games. Contact on the infield. It sneaks through. Thompson scores. Fraley through second tied. Fraley to third. And the go ahead run is 90 feet away. De La Cruz your perfect spot. Well, sometimes it's not about how hard you hit it. It's about where you can see this almost a check swing by Ellie De La Cruz and it gets through the infield first and third yet again. Perhaps see it go by the wayside again. It's just really tough. Nice pick De La Cruz. McNeil never dropped the bat. He hopped and spun in frustration as De La Cruz picked it. They talked about knowing where your infielders are and you see a ball hit into the air. Normally it's a fairly decent read. This was a little tougher. You can see the athleticism of Ellie De La Cruz, but. One of the fastest men alive is on. De La Cruz goes. Great break. Pitch called a strike. Throw down. Safe. Another steal for Ellie De La Cruz. There goes De La Cruz. Down and away and no throw. There was no one there. Beatty never broke. 
figure the only way that he is going to be able to score is on a base hit. So you're defending the base hit. And no catcher likes anyone to steal a base on him. So Alvarez is definitely coming out thinking throwing, but defensively, you want to take third base? Go ahead. The way to pitch him is to add and subtract speed. De La Cruz in the air, deep right center. He knew it. That was a strike a pose moment as he pointed to the dugout and a good amount of Reds fans here. Give a pretty loud roar. Ali De La Cruz base hit two walks yesterday. He's one for his last 14. Pretty well hit. Right field. Hanniger back. And that is gone. The Reds strike first. De La Cruz pulls one to right center. One nothing. Miller's working Fraley on the inside part of the plate. That pitch was inside. Nelly just destroyed it. Lifted in between. De La Cruz, long sprint on the slide, reaches up and makes the play. A stellar grab by De La Cruz. Oh, my goodness. A burner put it in what looked to be no man's land, but the human cheat code denied. But the catcher is not part of most of those caught stealings. De La Cruz goes, a hoppy throw down, late. Most of their caught stealing success has come on pickoffs. De La Cruz, best Ohapi and Anderson. A great jump going on first movement. Ohapi, you can see, had trouble making the transfer. There he goes again. 2-0 is called a strike, bad throw. De La Cruz pops up, he can walk home. It's a run. It's one nothing. Base hit through the infield. Stolen base on second to second base on the lefty. Lefty really has no chance throwing him out at third base. Well hit to left. Ward can't get there. That's gone. Opposite way in a big way. A three run shot. And the major pad for the Reds, his sixth of the year, makes it a six-run edge. Well, we talked about these Reds being able to hit the ball the other way. High fly, rocket launch to left center. Splash down, De La Cruz. His seventh of the year, seven runs for the Reds. I mean, I don't know many people that can go backside like that and hit the ball 110 off the bat. <laughs> My goodness. I mean, you know when you get one. He got one. Wow. Hardest hit ball of the game and time to strike a pose. You know what he does this year. Benson goes, pitch, slug to center. Rojas going back, it's over his head! And it skips over the fence! A big inning for the Red Legs. De La Cruz drives in another. Benson sent back to third. It's 5-3. Now that's what we want to see from the right-hand side from Ellie De La Cruz. That's putting on the brakes. Good hitting. He's running. Big jump. Kelly is one of the best catch and throw catchers in the business. And running down three in the ninth. I mean, you could just tell he was going to be super aggressive from the jump. Gets an amazing jump and a decent pitch to throw on for Carson Kelly. But we'll get another look at it. It's going to be close. Paul stands. Not enough to overturn. Smash to center field. A Zokar, no shot. Into the Padre pen. The team leading eighth for Ellie De La Cruz. And the Reds grab an early 1 0 lead. That well, looked like Waldron tried to get a sinking fastball down and into Ellie and just left that out over the plate. 443 feet later, he'll come around, tag home, and put the Reds on the board. Rolled up the middle. No play. Base hit, De La Cruz. 
The no-no spoiled with one down in the sixth. Exciting as we've seen in, in a little bit of time. De La Cruz, of course, has the combination of speed and power and takes that one right down the third baseline into left field. He's thinking too. Profar had trouble with it and now a turn of second base by De La Cruz, but he will hold on. As Pro 17 straight retired. De La Cruz down the left field line. Fair ball. Extra bases. De La Cruz. A standing double. Said John Jr. Summers. Ellie De La Cruz gives it a ride into left center field. Well hit back there to the warning track. It is out of here. Ellie De La Cruz launches home run number nine. Every day he does something that draws your attention. That dude. Free Jumbo Jacks tomorrow. For everybody in the LA area with the purchase of a large beverage. De La Cruz takes it the other way. That drops down in fair territory and then hops into the seats. The ground rule double for. Hard ground ball. Kicks off the glove of Cronenworth. Green light for Benson. He rips around third. Throw goes to second on a bounce. It's late. Hustle double. De La Cruz, Benson scores, two zip. Breaking ball down, Ellie does a nice job of staying on this ball, and he hits this ball really hard. Jumps up on Cronenworth, and look how he understood that it's a possible play at second base. So he turned on the Jets to make sure that if it was an out play at second base, that he would score. The game. Today, he has struck out twice. Goes opposite way, that has eyes, that is down fair, base hit. Skips into the stands, and... That'll hold him. Sends this ball to left center, and that is down base hit. Benson around third. He scores. De La Cruz up to second. A go-ahead stand-up double. He gets off the schneid. He snaps it 0 for 16, and the Reds take a 2-1 lead. Well, he went down and got a pretty good pitch. The first pitch down and away. It was on the corner. It was on the knees, and Ellie's got great play coverage. If he stays down there with his shoulder and head, and he does it right there. Stays right on it, drives it into the gap. That is driven to straightaway center. Doyle way back into the shrubbery. De La Cruz straight away. His team leading 10th, and it's two zip. What did Candelario say? Don't let the Reds get hot. Don't let Ellie get hot. Well, when Ellie gets hot, uh, look out. That hangs some. De La Cruz a long way to run deep in the outfield. He makes the play. Fantastic fielding by Ellie De La Cruz. Understand how difficult a play this is right here. Look how long this ball is in the air and how far he has to go making adjustments couple of times takes his eye off the ball to check where Spencer Steer is and under control he is playing some great baseball right now and he rocks this ball to right out of line Gone. what a bat flip he smokes his 11th of the year one year to the day of his highly heralded debut the beverage explode <laughs> trying to catch him oh. with the cup and man did he work it Bouncing ball should score a run if Jankowski can beat it, but De La Cruz with the arm, and he can't beat the play as De La Cruz throws him out. What a play by Ellie De La Cruz. Jankowski with wonderful speed, and De La Cruz might be the only person that could have thrown him out. De La Cruz way out. Preserves the no hit bid. Athleticism on display that uh, uh, with interference, with interference on top of it. And right there, the sliding backhand play, I, I'll tell you, there, there are not too many players, forget shortstops, not too many players that can make that play. And he hits the first ball to right center. That's down to the gap, that's all the way to the wall. Windmill is on for Friedel. De La Cruz storming for third. Relay goes to third. Friedel scores. RBI triple. 
A three bagger for De La Cruz, who has a two hit day, and the Reds have a two run lead. You got the feeling he was going to do something special. You said it before the game. I think he's going to have a big throw. I thought he was going to hit one off the Tacoma out there. But man, it is fun to watch that guy run. And is roped over first base in. De La Cruz eyeing at least two. Freely gathers in the corner. De La Cruz steaming for second. He goes right through. Here's the relay to third base. A slide safe. Triple for De La Cruz. That's and he smokes that ball up the middle. And it changes things in so many ways because when he gets on base, what's the domino effect of that speed lying in wait? When that left foot dip. There he goes. Pitch called a strike. Throw down tails of it. Squirts out of the glove. And there is a baseball best 50 second swipe for Ellie De La Cruz. He winds and fires to the talented De La Cruz, and it's lined to right center. A base hit. Over to cut it off. Josh Lowe. Wide turn for De La Cruz. He's going for two. The throw. And he is out at second base. Two hardest hit balls of this game delivered by Ellie De La Cruz. And there's his third base knock of the day. De La Cruz goes first pitch up and away. Throw down. Safe again. His second steal. There he goes again. Pitch tail down and away. Tall throw. And he slides safely. Now takes off. Swing and miss. Throw down from his knees. Bounces away. De La Cruz bursts for third. His second career four steal game. Steal E2. And now he's 90 feet away. Maybe Koenig is only going to face De La Cruz. This ball's crushed. Left field hit deep. And it is gone. That is out of here to left. Just over the left field wall. That'll be a solo home run for De La Cruz. It's his 12th home run of the year. And it's back to a one run Brewer lead. That was a laser out of here to left. Well the Reds have finally found the spot where they can't catch him. And that's over the wall. The other way for Ellie De La Cruz. That is a fair ball. Hugging the line and bounces out of play. Line caught by De La Cruz. He snow cone snared it. Uh, Ellie De La Cruz comes to help his pitchers in so many different ways. And this defensive grab right here. Because he uses all of his six foot five frame and he gets way out there to be able to get that ball and not for style points, <laughs> just to make the play. I give him the points. Runner breaks contact. De La Cruz to the plate. It's there. Out and home play. De La Cruz to Maley and they cut down the sliding try of Verdugo. It's a nice play by Ellie De La Cruz. He fields this ball very low. He's got to get right down there to get it. And field it, throws it in one motion. Perfect throw. I mean, Maley doesn't have to move at all. High fly, deep right. Watch it in wonder. Number 13 for Ellie De La Cruz. It also helps when he just hit it over the fence. Because when that borderline call goes your way, it gives you another opportunity, or more importantly, it tells that pitcher. He's not calling that pitch, so I better throw a strike. There's the strike. Bye bye, baseball. Thoughts on the moves that were made? Bounce to short, good backhand. De La Cruz from the outfield green against a fast man. Pete Crow Armstrong has De La Cruz like quicks and gets cut down by the Reds' All Star shortstop. Yeah, and it looked like the LA De La Cruz needed to put a little extra mustard on this one. Let's get the radar gun on that. Turned on and laced to left. All the way to the wall. De La Cruz sprinting for second. Stand up double. Ellie De La Cruz now has six of the nine hardest hit balls for the Reds from the right side of the year. Up the middle. Past the backhand of Gonzalez. India rips around third. He scores. De La Cruz to second. Head first plunge. And he grabs two. Do not take your eyes off this man. It is amazing what he's capable of doing. You talked about him hitting the ball hard. I love the fact that he hits the ball hard, but I love how hard he plays. That's Ellie De La Cruz. He just makes it look so easy. 
the balls hit hard to him and he just ranging over to his right what would be tough for a lot of guys but because of his quickness and his agility he's able to lay out finds the perfect angle comebacker off Montas's glove De La Cruz barehand throw to first got him ball hit up the middle and Ellie puts on the brakes the long arm of the law he's glad that didn't get Frankie so Frankie hit earlier this season in the right forearm that one didn't make contact I think he hit it the glove good play on a 2 2 from Lugo he shoots one into center field that will get down and we get to see De La Cruz on the bases he throws on the brakes Jared Ram fires that ball back in and he's got the Reds fans fired up he's got baseball fans fired up with him on base. Here's Green's 1 1 pitch. There goes Carroll. Swinging a line drive right up the middle to Ellie De La Cruz, who makes the catch. And now will tag out Corbin Carroll for the unassisted double play. He was running and ran right into the double play. So the inning is over. We go to the bottom of the fifth, halfway through it at Great American Ballpark. Smoked and caught. Great play, Ellie De La Cruz. Uh, this ball was smoked and Ellie just extended the go go gadget arms. There are not many shortstops in this world that are going to make this play right here. Runners go double steal pitch tail down and in snap throw down tag is late. A double steal by the Reds as Benson and De La Cruz claim third and second. You could kind of feel that coming. Of course, De La Cruz is going on Benson and only Benson. So you see Benson kind of sneaking off and then got a good jump right there. The throw would have been right on the money to make it close. Ten hits last night, 11 so far tonight. That's the kind of offensive production we'd like to see. De La Cruz unloads. Down twice, chopped to De La Cruz. Top play on the run. Speedy runner, and he got him. The highlight reel continues to grow for Ellie De La Cruz. This is all about the first step right here. Ellie De La Cruz, look at all the ground that he covers. And as I talked about, there's no panic whatsoever. And the length, just being able to leverage that ball across the diamond, he just continues to amaze. Three for four yesterday, two doubles. De La Cruz on the ground. Here's Ellie De La Cruz deep in the hole. One hot oh, throw. Oh. Got him in plenty of time. That's the arm strength of Ellie De La Cruz. And he shows it off to retire the side. Two and a half steps out of the outfield grass, no problem. Getting on a tongue. De La Cruz first pitch to center. Taylor the dive it gets by India through second claims third De La Cruz up to second takes it standing. And Tyler Stevenson locked in De La Cruz takes off on the pitch. Oh he read it beautifully. That was a delayed steal by the time the ball got to the plate. The catcher Joey Bart pumped once before he ever threw the ball to second because there was nobody at second base. And is sent through the right side base hit. Wave is on for Benson. Scooping right by Brian De La Cruz. Throw to third for India. It's late. Ellie De La Cruz to second. Throw there is late. 
Roll to second. Tough play gets by the backhand of Connor Falefa. India never breaks stride. De La Cruz going for second. India scores. Ellie De La Cruz, a double. He drives in another. Reds by seven. You cannot sleep with Ellie at the plate. <laughs> that is sent to left base hit. De La Cruz, that's his third knock. He's on four times tonight. Ellie's been hot again, Chris. His last 12 games, 362, getting on base and hitting for more power again. And he cracks this ball to right center, splashes down base hit. India rips through second. It rolls all the way to the track. India given the green light, whipped around third. De La Cruz steaming for third base. India scores Ribby triple. One nothing Reds. Well, when he controls his swing and he puts the ball on the square part of the bat, I mean, the ball really carries. It just comes off so easily. He fires first pitch on the ground of the backhand of De La Cruz. He fields one hop throw is on target in time to get Nick Gonzalez. See, that's the good one hop throw. It's the long hop. It was a little bit into the runner, but not bad. Candelario is still able to get it easily. And Nick Gonzalez is out number one in the sixth. Opposite way. Down base hit. Windmill on a third. India scores. De La Cruz starts into second. It's a double. Three straight two baggers begin the inning. And a 2 nothing Reds lead. Really good bit of hitting by De La Cruz. Get your swing under control when you have two strikes. I don't mean you just try to flip it in the left field, but you just don't go up there and swing completely as hard as you can. Said I made, in my own opinion, an inexcusable mistake. I missed with a fastball in the zone to maybe their best fastball hitter. This is rope to short. Diving stop. Ellie De La Cruz on the fly. Two down. A really nice play and athleticism from Ellie De La Cruz. Not a lot of time to react and just love to see when he extends how much ground he covers. That play is not made by most human beings. He just continues to impress with his athleticism. Scott Rowland, of course, set the stage here as a terrific defender. David Cruz line drive down the right field line. That's extra bases. Burleson gathers. David Cruz trying for three. Here's the relay. Late. Triple Ellie De La Cruz, and he's 90 feet away. Ben. Rolled up the middle, throw, base hit. Wave on Candelario. Greenell flies to third. De La Cruz, Ribby single, 4 2. Up the middle, broken bat. De La Cruz by. Recovery by De La Cruz. He covers the ground and he cuts him down at first base. Ellie De La Cruz rips one down the right field line. That's a fair ball. Kicks to the wall. De La Cruz darts up to second. Soto just now gathers. De La Cruz visions for third. Soto's throw to third base. Head first slide. Triple. What a tone setter. Snaps a string of nine in a row retired. Well, when Ellie De La Cruz finally gets it into gear, I mean, it is just so smooth. And he knows he's got two. But he watches Soto and then says, there's no way he's throwing me out of third. And he drills this ball to left center. That's got great carry. That splashes down to the pen. De La Cruz goes deep. He's got 15. A pair of two-run taters for the Reds in a four-run fifth. Well, maybe New York City is his kind of town. Well, he begins to show some of the doubters about his right-handedness, whether he's got power from the right side. You can check that box. That's his fourth homer, batting right-handed on the year. Benson takes off, and the pitch is ripped to right center. Blackman breaking back. That skips to the wall. Windmill on for Benson. Here's the throw to the plate. Safe slide, Benson. Ribby double, De La Cruz, and a four-run edge for the Reds. What a beautiful swing. Head down behind the baseball. That ball is driven. And Will Benson, who has plenty of speed, moving on the swing, sees that ball in the gap. Gets back up to speed and scores easily. De La Cruz drilled it 113 plus. You got Ellie De La Cruz hitting. You got two outs. Let's just let the man swing the bat. Runners off. That is sent past Monasterio. Base hit. Benson around third. He scores. Freelich fires to Adamas in second. India to third. 
Ellie De La Cruz with a ribby single. 3-1 Cincinnati. There goes De La Cruz. Pitch called a strike. Throw down is late. De La Cruz with his big league best 27th steal. Well, that was not on the catcher, I'll tell you that, because De La Cruz had a big lead and a big jump. You add them together at his speed, and he's in there before the throw gets there. Opposite way. That's cranked well. That is down. Base hit. Kicks corner into the stands, and that's going to hold him to a double. Oh, Chris, if that wall were just a little bit taller. And he likes to steal third base as much as he, anything else, and there he goes. Takes off, pitch strike, no throw, no cover. He zips over for a second steal of the game, give him 28 on his stellar season. Here goes De La Cruz. Called strike, throw down, late. A three steal night for Ellie De La Cruz. He has a swipe all three times he's been on the bases. And he does it with a smile on his face. I mean, he just basically outruns the baseball right here. Gets a good jump, even though it was a fastball, kind of a modified pitch out for Tyler Glass now. Big lead for De La Cruz. He takes off, pitch swing and a miss, throw down, it's wide. He stayed on the bag. It's a career high four steals for 4 4. Well, he comes into the base so hard right there that his momentum took him over the base, but. Hernandez had to field that throw a little bit on the foul line. You see him sliding after that throw from Austin Barnes, and by the time he got the tag back, Ellie's all backing up right. And he's on for the fourth time today. <laughs> That's three base hits for De La Cruz, who is a steal away from the franchise single game record. Lifted to left, longer runs. That's gonna fall. Ellie ball up to second base. A bloop double. To Ellie De La Cruz on the backhand, snaps off the throw. That's a speedy runner, and De La Cruz caught him down. Ellie De La Cruz catches this ball in perfect rhythm and gets rid of it right away. That is a fantastic play. So impressive how Ellie plays out there, and he's able to get his use his power source. Oh, he yeah. rolled that right foot. You're two in Milwaukee, and a line drive caught by De La Cruz. Ellie De La Cruz lays out and makes the grab. Need all of his height right there. This was a rocket. You are right. What is it? Six six. He used every inch he had to make that play. Full extension. Step in a dive. Nice play by Ellie De La Cruz. Two down in the inning. First pitch high fly right center. Trevor Rogers has been really good. He left the ball out over the plate to Jonathan India, and he hits it for the double and leaves another one right out there over the plate to Ellie De La Cruz. Runner goes, great jump, pitch swung on, back broken, it spins to the netting. De La Cruz on the back pedal has it, fire the first double play. Twin killing courtesy of L.A. De La Cruz. He was running on the pitch. Ellie backing up, makes the catch in short center, and the Reds get an inning ending double play. Chipped up the middle, full extension, L.A. De La Cruz. That shade to the logo that's right on the middle of his shirt. Yeah, the timing of this is everything. And he's able to get his body in position, time it perfectly. And he definitely knows how to use that length. Two out base runner for Ellie. There goes Jonathan. In the left field, down the left field line. India on his way to third. They're going to wave him around. 
De La Cruz will make the turn. He's on his way to third base. Head first slide, and the Reds retake the lead. And it's up and out over the plate, and he gets around it right down the third base line. Kicked around in the corner a little bit. That's the reason why Ellie ends up at third base. I think that Indy would have scored no matter what. Up the middle, base hit center field. Herdebees in to score. De La Cruz makes it three to one, Cincinnati. Talked about his timing and getting on time. He was on time with on time with this pitch. Watch how quick the bat gets through the zone, right up the middle. And that had to feel good for him. And you know, of late, been struggling to put the ball in play, and there's a hard hit baseball with an RBI. Topped. Grazes the glove of Desenzo. Espinal scores. Rosario scores. It's a seven spot for the Reds in the first inning. Well, this ball just topped right at the plate. Just bad luck, but this ball just going right over the glove of Desenzo at first base. And there's another hard hit ball. That'll reach the gap in right center field. You can just chalk up a triple on this one. On his way. Nope, he's going to hold up at second. We are so used. To him, just going for three no matter what, but a changing type ability. And he rips one over first base, extra bases. Goes to the wall, Adam Duvall after it, it deadens at the base of the wall. De La Cruz sprinting through second, he challenges for three. There is no relay, head first slide, and a triple. That's the game changing ability I'm talking about. And not only. Newt Barr, hard ground ball. Nice backhand, De La Cruz. Fire to first is there. Got him. Talked about Eli, how Ellie De La Cruz makes things look so easy. Get that bullet across the diamond. De La Cruz, high fly, deep right center, and gone. A lucky kid in the stands catches it on the fly. A great at bat by De La Cruz. It almost appeared as though Ellie came to the plate looking for something off speed out over the plate. You could see he was a little tardy on a couple of those fastballs that were 88, 89, but yet he is right on time on the changeup. Left field, all oh, that's trouble. Pro Armstrong scores. Magical green light. De La Cruz relay. It's there. He is out. Herdebees and De La Cruz cut him down at the plate. Two outs, and the lead preserved at one. Wow, good fundamental baseball by Jacob Herdebees down in the corner. Cuts the ball off, gets rid of it quickly, but the important part, hit the cutoff man. I mean, that cutoff man is Ellie De La Cruz. He's going to fire a rocket to home. Shallow left. De La Cruz going way out on the run, extends and makes the play. There are not many shortstops that could corral that ball, but De La Cruz did. His brightest offensive star is Ellie De La Cruz. He drives to left center beyond the dive of half. De La Cruz zips up to second. Pro Armstrong gathers. Strong throw into third. First base runner of the night. Opposite way double for De La Cruz. First pitch clobbered. That is drilled over top of the pen. The long launch by De La Cruz. Two batters in, it's 2-0 Reds. Well, a nice easy swing by De La Cruz. Maybe a get-ahead fastball right there by Munoz. And that's something that you should not do. Looks like he got what he was waiting for, and he didn't have to wait long. It was on the first pitch, and he just hit a laser out of here to right over the Reds' bullpen. Smack to right. A smoke liner that skips to the fence. India rips up to third. De La Cruz has extra bags. He pummels a double and it's second and third. Pounded on the ground to short. Tough backhand. Long throw for De La Cruz. Got him! Dynamite play from the red shortstop. Uh, one of the best infield arms in all of baseball. And he needed it right here to be able to get the runner going down to first base. Sets his feet, cuts it loose. 
And a nice stretch at the other end by Spencer Steer. And throw at 86. Reached on an error and ended up scoring a run back in the third inning. And he hits this one into right field. And that one is off the wall. Sanchez will get this one in, but it's another double and the third extra base hit of the night for Ellie De La Cruz. Well hit, <laughs> deep right. The power of De La Cruz. Four extra base hits. He just crushed his second homer of the game. What a souvenir. Reds get one back in a big way. To short, tough play on a backhand. De La Cruz got him. Once again, Ellie De La Cruz is extending and then showing that absolute cannon. A nice job by Ty France at first base picking this ball up. My, oh my. If we can, I got to see the reaction of TJ Friedel in center field. He normally lays off the inside pitch. Oh, he smashes this one down the right field line. That's extra bases. De La Cruz sprints up to second, gathered by Stowers. Standing double for De La Cruz, who now has six hits this series. Payoff. That is lifted down the left field line. Twisting trouble. That is down fair. It skips to the fence. Fraley scores. Marte scores. India to third. Another double for De La Cruz. He drives in two. He is three for three. And the Reds up four nothing. Uh, make it seven hits in the last two nights for Ellie De La Cruz. This may have been the most impressive of all. Slicing, hit hard, goes all the way to the wall in left field. Top to short, backhand, long throw. Got oh, him! Oh, 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 doctor! An electric play from Senor and Atisidad. I'm not sure if you're going to see a better play by a shortstop in a month. He turns on the first pitch. High fly, deep right, back to back. Two out thunder. He leads the team with 21. The Reds lead the game 3-1. to one. Well, no time to take a breath. Spencer Shear with the two-run home run and the next pitch. Ambush fastball. Love it. Just the third time all year, Gray has been touched up for multiple homers. That is rope to right center base hit. De La Cruz eyeing two. Here's the throw. Hustle double. Also a fly ball out to left. Hard ground ball past the backhand of Arenado. That's extra bases. Marte through second. Windmill is on at third. Marte roared home. Fan throw from left. Caught at third base. Marte scores. De La Cruz drills a double and expands the Reds' lead back to seven. It's a nice bit of hitting right there by Ellie De La Cruz. Breaking ball. I think the one common thing we've seen today is pitches have been up in the zone. That was a breaking ball that didn't have the depth on it, and that ball was rocketed as well. De La Cruz smooth on the backhand. That play was pretty. Elliott has been playing some great shortstop. Look how low he gets in catching this ball. And that is leveraging the ball across first to first base. Watch the little bit of effort that he has to put into this. Poked over first. Just fair. Melendez up to second. Fraley's got it. Melendez dig it for third. Relay De La Cruz. Out! What a throw from the red shortstop! And he cuts down Melendez at third base! And then, oh man, let the ball eat with a dime from Ellie De La Cruz. Top to short, backhand De La Cruz, long throw! Got him! Again! Well, they keep testing him out and he keeps making the plays. Really nice job right there, no panic, kind of snow cone that ball. And this time perfectly placed out in front of Ty France. Allowing him to make the play. Excellent. Here's a liner to left center field and that's going to get past Varsho. And De La Cruz can fly. He is racing around second and on his way into third with a stand up triple. Down the left field line good carry. 
and gone. De La Cruz goes deep. 22 on his year. 11-6 Cincinnati. Boy, the leverage that Ellie De La Cruz has when he puts the ball on the sweet part of the bat. A lot of guys have to pull the ball to get it out of the ballpark. De La Cruz goes right down the opposite line. That ball looked like it popped straight up into the air. De La Cruz's first move was back to the bag. Just got a word from Colin Calgill, first base coach, in his ear. He goes pickoff. Tag. Awkward and missed late. The Cubs guessed right, and De La Cruz still sped him up and took second base. Michael Bush gets this ball. You see the rush. Understands Ellie De La Cruz is running. Safe on the bad throw. Roll to second. Tough play. Gets by the back hand of Connor Falefa. India never breaks stride. De La Cruz going for second. India scores. Ellie De La Cruz a double. He drives in another. Reds by seven. You cannot sleep. With Ellie at the plate. No glove on. Fairly well hit to right center. Freelich just gets it on the backhand. De La Cruz up to second base. A standing double. And he takes off for third as the ball got lost. And he slides in safely. I came in where the players come in at. Because I'm a player. Get up in there. Oh, he's saying he can't throw that. He ain't got no arm like that. No, he don't. Oh, he does, though. No, he don't. Oh, oh, oh he does. Who is that with that, that rocket? Ellie De La Cruz. Oh, Lord. With a howitzer. He got a rocket in his pocket. <laughs> oh, he something. made that. Are you, are you having fun? I'm having too much can fun. Can you hang? I can hang like I'm supposed to. Hard base hit. India through second. Hicklin scoops it right. De La Cruz starts to second. A hammered standing. Cranks that to right field. Base in. To the wall. Extra bases gathered by Gamble. It's another standing double for De La Cruz. He is three for three. That is drilled. Left center field. Good carry. Good night. 23 for Ellie De La Cruz. He has tied the game and he's tied the red single season record for homers by a switch hitter in a season. His first homer since the 21st of August. He matches the mark set by Felipe Lopez, who had assumed the starting shortstop role from Barry Larkin at 05. And De La Cruz matches him with this stroke. Cruz does not yet have a grand slam in his career. First pitch, high fly. He does now. The first granny for Ellie De La Cruz. The red shortstop Dynamo outright sets the red single season record for homers by a switch hitter in the seventh inning. It's seventh heaven thanks to De La Cruz. A 7-1 lead for the Reds.